Nivea's Q10 Plus anti-wrinkle line helps offer smooth, younger-looking skin. Today's audience will all take home a Nivea Q10 Plus firming body lotion and an anti-age hand cream. <laughs> and we'll be drawing to this gift basket with the complete line after the show. Well, we do have enough time to get to another audience question. This is Trudy, and this came in uh, via email. So we'll get both of you to answer it. What does she need help with? So basically, she has an existing um, space. She's got older furniture, and she doesn't love it. She says it's uncomfortable and, you know, dated. She's got a baby on the way. So she, her question is, what kind of furniture, what kind of layout, and then what kind of fabrics do I, uh, do right. I work with? So it's kind of sectional day today on the city line, <laughs> yeah. but um, I really do think that the room lends itself to a sectional. It's quite open uh, concept. So when you come in, this is the entrance entrance way here. Let me just grab that pen. Entrance way here. So there's not a lot of space to put furniture here. And then I believe I'm not 100% sure, but I believe this backs into the dining room. So we want we don't want to have anything that compromises that space. Right. Which is why I think a sectional is ideal. That way. She can snuggle in. They, you know, the baby can actually um, lie down on this sectional. Mm -hmm. yeah. And even though there isn't a lot of wall space, I'd still place the TV here and put it on the wall with an arm. Okay, so it can swing around where you need it. Nice again, upholstered ottoman is great. So as that baby grows, we're not going to have a problem with, mm -hmm. uh, um, you know, Spill bumping. It. Well, spillage and bumping yeah. their head. Yes. And, yeah. Oh, yes. So I wouldn't do a coffee table. I would do an upholstered ottoman. I like that. You know, I have to say, Trudy, when, when I looked at the picture, and I, I'm going to say this because Trudy already said she doesn't like her sofa. Yeah. So when I was looking at the picture and I saw the email and it said, I'm having a baby, I was like, what? That's not possible. I was like, how old is she that she's having a baby? I was like, what? No, that can't be right. I was like, let's look again. No. But you no. thought the sofa belongs <laughs> to someone wrong. who's 105, yeah. right? Yeah, so I mean, you know, listen, she, she doesn't like the sofa, so I've allowed myself to say that. But, the, the, you know, it's interesting. I mean, right down to the Afghan on the rocker. I mean, it's right down to the, it's like, it, 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 reminds, it reminds me of my grandmother a little. Um, you know what, I, the, the situation is probably that they started, they started the new home yes. and they took the furniture. 100%. Right. They took some furniture from their parents' place which is or okay, whatever. Yeah. Which is okay. But you know what? Trudy did, did a great job choosing the artwork. I really yeah. actually like the pieces above the sofa. And I think that this is going to be a really nice jumping off point for you, Trudy. So yeah. in terms of colorways and things like that, you have all the work done for you here, the way that the artists have incorporated the colors together. The work is done for you, so that's going to make that a lot easier for you. In terms of fabric choices that you're going to choose for your new sectional, which I agree with Karen, I think a sectional is really the way to go. It's it's nice, it fills up the space, you have additional seating. Very comfortable. 100%. Mm -hmm. um, you have a baby on the way and, you know, baby spillage, so uh, microfibers are super easy to care for. Um, Some umbrella fabrics are also <laughs> really great. Yeah, no, it's true. Go for outdoor fabric. You it could is. go out for outdoor fabric. You can wash it. It's also, um, you know, it doesn't uh, hold the, um, again, any spills. Yep. It's not right. going to, it's micro. Microbial, I can't think of it. You know, microbial. Wait, yeah. Yeah. microbial yep. Yep. Yes. Yep. Microbial. So, you know, that's really good for young families as well. Mm -hmm. So I would I would look at that. Because they're so beautiful now. They're gorgeous. Oh, there's they're amazing really fabrics nice. that you can get out there. Now, I think that just, you know, for, for ease, when you're going out there and looking for the fabric, you want to look for a fabric that doesn't have a very uh, large weave or a very large loom in it. Something that the kid mm -hmm. can't, you know, get their nails cut Flatter. on. My, think of your child like a little cat. You, you know, they're <laughs> sharp little nails. They, they get in there and they rip things peeing on the sofa, all that kind of stuff. So we want to make sure that, you know, it's something that's easy to care for, something that's soft, something that's going to carry you through at least the next five years. Yeah. And relatively neutral. Yes. Because you've got the color on the wall already with the art, mm -hmm. you yeah. want to bring those colors maybe in some toss cushions, yeah. maybe a nice area rug, yeah. but keep that sectional nice and neutral, and that way it's going to give you a lot of longevity. So if you decide in 10 years that you want to change it up yeah. a bit, you've got that ability. Absolutely. Right. I don't know about you, Karen, but when our family was really young, it's like the coffee table slash ottoman is just moved to the side and that becomes play <laughs> area. Exactly. That's just, you You live on the ground when you've got young children, right? So you want something that's going to be easily movable. Invest in the nice hot coffee table a little bit later. Yes. Exactly. Right? Yeah. Absolutely. Okay, well, thanks for your advice today. I love that. A lot of fireplaces. <laughs> a lot of, yeah, a lot of solutions for those. Sectionals. Lots of sectionals. <laughs> a lot of sectionals. So keep in mind all of those tips and we'll see you tomorrow on City Line. Have a good day. Thank you.